blessed child, you are now seated in heavenly places. You have been separated unto your God eternally, my child. You have been caught up in spirit and truth. You see my face. You dwell with me in paradise. I breathe on you this day, my child. I breathe new life into your heart, mind and soul. You are free. Completely free in the will of God. My plan, my eternal plan and purpose for your life. You seek only my will, my heart's desires. My blessed one, come spend time with your father this day. I wish to speak with you. I wish to reveal unto you my mysteries. I wish to take you on the most magnificent journey. Oh my Lord, such peace floods my soul on this day. Such joy fills my spirit. I am eternally thankful, eternally happy to be with you as this. To be with my God one on one, to hear your voice, to fly with you in spirit and in truth. Oh, there is nothing greater than the love that is circling me now, your love. I feel light, I feel free. Freed through the blood of Jesus Christ, my Lord and Saviour. It is for freedom that Christ has set me free, and I am free. All the chains have been broken. I am free to soar in the heavenly realms, free to see. I love you, my Lord. Thank you for this perfect day. Thank you for drawing so near to my soul. I embrace you with all who I am. On my face I bow before you, totally consumed by your love. I love you eternally. There is nothing greater for a human soul than to love the Lord our God with all our heart, mind, soul and strength. There is nothing greater. To be wrapped karahashi kiti hoshi kiti in your love, filled with your Holy Spirit. Oh, the joy, the joy of my soul at this time. To be in paradise, flooded with glory. Come, my child, tell me all you are seeing on this day as we journey into the heavenly realms together. I see my angel beside me. I see him smiling, he is so happy. He cannot wait to get started, to go deeper to show me all there is to see. For this is his home, his heavenly dwelling place, and he knows it well. I smile at him. So, she got filled with joy and happiness. Laughter. I feel like a little child about to embark on the greatest journey. Kapotera with her father. Kashikiti karabasikia hashikiti tia hashikiti. 
Every part of me is filled with such excitement. My angel takes my hand and we begin to run. Run towards Karahashikitiki, a paradise. The holy city, the new Jerusalem. We run. We are running through meadows filled with flowers and the fragrance. The fragrance of Allah is so delightful to my soul. I see little flowers everywhere. I see butterflies. I can hear the air is warm around me. The smell is sweet. A sweet fragrance fills the air. The ground is soft. Like the softest grass I have ever felt. I feel a lot like I'm in a body, but I also feel like I am spirit. I feel tangible, but I feel so free, unrestricted. We are light. I feel like I could fly. My child, in my new heavenly realm, my lady Anoko, you are weightless. You are in spirit. Therefore, my child, you can fly. You can go anywhere in my kingdom with just a thought. You can lift off the ground. You do not need to walk along a ground. You are in spirit, my child. Remember. My angel comes so close. I can feel him. Spirit. He is so beautiful. He is filled with heaven's glory. He is pure, without sin. Beautiful one. I am your guardian angel, and I will show you all there is to see so that the world might come to salvation through Jesus Christ. The Holy One of Heaven. Our King, our Lord. Our the One we serve. I am a Holy Angel of Heaven. And I have been put in charge of your life. Since the moment you were born, I have followed your days. I let our have protected you and sheltered you. I have kept you from harm, from danger. I have battled for your soul, dear one. You are so precious in my sight. I would do anything for you. And now, I will protect you in the heavenly realms. I will protect you on the earth. I will protect your spirit. As you fly higher, higher each day. Remember you are still on the earth. And on the earth, it is very dangerous for your soul. There is great evil afoot on the earth. Therefore, I will protect you in spirit and in truth. You can trust me, my child. I will not let you down. I know the day is ordained for you. And I am with you to help you fulfill all the Lord needs for the people of the earth. So that many will come to salvation, many will fall to their knees. So that every knee will bow and every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. You have a mighty You may have a mighty purpose on the earth for the kingdom of heaven. 
and it is only just the beginning. Our Lord, Karafahi and the desires to release heaven on earth. Karahashi to release his words concerning heaven so that the kingdom of heaven, Karahashi Kadahrohorhasi, is revealed. Kahashiki to Kurohoha to the hearts of men. Lord about the Rayua Karahashik embarking on a thousand days, Hashikatakar in glory with your sister in Christ. You are both seated in heavenly places at this time. And as here you will stay until every word is completed and the mysteries of God have been revealed. So relax, my child, for you do not have to leave. I feel like we are lifting in spirit. I feel like we are twirling in the universe. It is so beautiful. I see what looks like stars all around us, but I don't know. They look like diamonds in the sky, glistening. I don't know why they don't know where we are because I could have never seen such as this before but the Kiribati sky looks like it's covered in jewels, precious diamonds, rubies. All the colours of the rainbow. It's almost like snowdrops. Different coloured snowdrops all around me. I move my hands through this beautiful like balls of light. They move, they move with my hands moving through them. They move through me. I am one with the universe. The lights are all around me, but they are also in me now. I do not feel like I'm in a physical body. I'm completely broken down in spirit. I am weightless and free, but I'm very aware. I can think and feel. I can see and hear, but I do not know <laughs> where I am exactly, because I am, I just am with the universe, I am with God, I am part of his creation, <laughs> part of the atmosphere, <laughs> I see my angel's face smiling as he <laughs> realizes that I have never experienced such as this before. For him this is normal, to be able to move as the wind, to be able to be free out of time and space, out of gravity. I still feel his hand in mine. He stares deeply into my soul. There is a great love that we have. Kamathar, he knows me well. And I'm so thankful for his help, his protection, his guidance. Blessed children, this is your Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. He is speaking with you now. Come, my children, do not be afraid. I know you are so overjoyed to see each other. Like such a beautiful reunion of souls. 
It's almost like you were brother and sister, my children. This angel knows you so well. He was put in charge of your life. He follows my will and commandments concerning you. He watches over you intently. He never sleeps, my child. You are continually protected. 24 hours a day on your earth because he loves you so much and now you have been reunited and I am giving you the opportunity to see the one who looks after you night and day and I'm giving you the opportunity to spend time where he is in his dwelling place Hello to our Lord, such joy fills my soul, such burning fire, such love. Come now, my children. Come inside. Come deeper into my heavenly realm. You are only on the outskirts at this time, and there is so much to see. Take a step, one step in. A little boshi kitiki ahashi kana. I take a step, and the electricity, the energy of heaven, hori lahashi, nearly knocks me over. Like I do not know if I can take another step. A little boshi kitiki ahashi, for all of my cells are burning in glory, fire, life. Come on, my child, take one more step. A little bit. I don't think I can, my Lord. A little bit. I fall down on my knees in worship, in praise, overcome with the glory, just wanting to laugh and laugh and laugh because I feel so free. And my angel just smiles. He gave a little bit. She it at me. I cannot walk, my Lord. I feel so slain in the Spirit of God. But it's okay, my child. Just rest where you are. Take it all in. This is what every soul who returns unto me experiences. The absolute beauty of heaven. The freedom. Oh Lord, Halera Motara Sina Hashikiriya Hashikiri Thank you. Thank you for dying for our sins. Thank you for rising again so that we might have eternal life in your kingdom. How beautiful. I pray for every soul on the earth to come to know you this day, to believe. Oh, I do not want a single soul to miss out on this most amazing experience. The presence of God, the glory of heaven, the beauty, the colors, the fragrance. Oh, Lahri, I wish for every soul to be reunited with their guardian angel, the one who protects them. Oh, Rahashiki, my child, anyone who rejects me will be cast out of my kingdom. They will not come into paradise. And they will not spend eternity with their guardian angel, the one who took great care of their soul during their time on the earth. Anyone who rejects me will never spend time such as this in paradise. They will be separated from God. They will be taken away to a place of darkness and weeping and gnashing of teeth. Total separation from love because they rejected the one who is love. The one who promised them eternal life. Yahweh, the great I am. 
Hashikiki sent me to the earth to tell you, to warn you, to offer my life as a sacrifice for the sin of mankind. My death paid the price for every man's sin. You just need to accept and receive it, my children on the earth. And you will walk into paradise at life's end. You will fall down in the glory, unable to move. You will be so happy. Come, my child, walk into my kingdom further. I try to stand, but I am I feel like I'm hunched over. Thank you. I cannot, cannot stand, my Lord. It's too hard. I feel my angel's hand. It feels like his hand is on my shoulder. A little hot and his warmth. A little hot and bringing me back. I can't, can't move, my Lord. It's too beautiful here. I see my Lord smiling. He is so overjoyed. He is so beautiful. He loves me. And He's not angry at me. But even though he cares deeply for me, he's staring deep into my soul, his eyes, such beauty, such beautiful eyes. I see the angel beside me begin to worship. Lord Hashanah with all of his might. It's like he is breathing in the glory of heaven. It's like he's being filled. Halahadahashi with the oil of heaven, the glory. I stare into the eyes of my Lord Jesus, so in love. I could stay here forever, just staring deep into his eyes, never moving, never needing to move. For he completes every part of my mind, body and soul. He is complete peace and rest. He smiles knowing how I feel, the love in my heart. Oh, how I have loved you all my life, Lord Jesus. Oh, Karahashiki, thank you for coming towards me on the earth. For giving me dreams and visions and words of wisdom and knowledge and prophecy. Thank you for reaching out to me on the earth, for calling me into this great adventure with, along with my sister in Christ. Blessed child, you have both been chosen for such a time as this because you are pure of heart. You see my face. You walk in obedience. Diligently and obediently you recall these words for the nations because you love me. You want nothing in return. You just want to be with me night and day. All we want is you to gaze upon your beauty, to worship you, to be free, to dance, to sing, to rejoice in your name, to praise you. My child, I thank you for all you are doing this day. Thank you for releasing these words of heaven to the nation. Thank you for giving me your time, your love. I bless you now, Karahelehra, with peace. Peace in abundance. You will release peace on the earth. You will release my joy. 
you will release heaven. You will release my glory through these words, through your physical temple. The oil of heaven will flow. The mysteries of God. My words will not return void, my children, but they will go forth and accomplish all which I have predestined them to crash, to accomplish. Oh Lord, of Ahinahara on my knees, I bow before you. I worship you. I give you all the praise, all the honor. You are the Holy Lamb who was slain for the sins of the world. You are our Redeemer, our Saviour, our Lord and our King. You are the Son of God. Allah, part of the Holy Trinity, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. You are the Jewish Messiah, the sacrificial lamb, the Lion of Judah. My child, I care for each and every person on the earth at this time and that is why I'm sending you both to release these words to the nations. For me, my children, I want that none shall perish but all shall come to eternal life, all shall come to glory, to paradise. I do not want a single soul to be separated from me, from heaven. I am calling out to all my children to come to me this day, to bow your knee, and you will walk into paradise at life's end, you will walk into glory, your name will be written in the book of life, you will be cleansed by the blood of the lamb, the blood, my blood, given for the world, given for you all. Do not forsake me at this hour, my children, time draws nigh. The earth groans with age. If you are feeling unrest, if you do not know me, if you are feeling depressed and anxious, come to me this day. Allow my peace to fill you. Allow my love to encircle you. Allow these servants of Christ to take you on a journey through heaven each day. There is so much more to see. This is only just the beginning. My servants are only taking the first few steps into paradise. But soon they will enter deep within, deep into the Father's mind the Father's heart, for He holds all things together, He holds the whole of heaven together, the whole of the universe, He is the universe, and He's inviting you to step into His creative ideas, His thoughts, His mind, who He is. And he will reveal unto you mysteries, mysteries hidden. But now to be revealed at such a time as this, now is the time for the books to be open. The thoughts, the plans, the love of God to be released amongst the nations. A great harvest of souls will begin. A little while every knee that bows will be caught up to heaven. But any person who rejects me, who walks away from this message, from my love, I promise you will not see paradise at life's end. You will not walk in glory. You will be forsaken. Because Allah you rejected me on the earth. Oh I'm crying out to every child now, come to me, confess that I am your Lord. 
confess your sins, repent, turn from your wicked ways and come. Come, Karheshka, running into my arms. Come on this journey into heaven, this thousand day journey into heaven. Oh Lord, she washed you live upon the earth and allow my peace to fill you, to fill your physical temple. Allow this peace to overflow into your world, into your homes. Allow my peace to encircle you. Be filled with my Holy Spirit. Be born again. Do not go back to your wicked ways, your sins, but walk away from them this day. Whatever it is that you keep doing, that you know is wrong, I ask that you stop today. Draw a line in the sand and never do it again. I wish to transform you all into my likeness and image, into the image of your Lord. I wish for you to have the mind of Christ. And now I wish to show you how to worship in spirit and truth. To fly freely through the heavenly realms. To be in peace. Perfect peace. Perfect contentment. my Lord, Thank you, thank you for inviting us all into this journey. I pray many will come. I pray many will walk with us each day. Please draw many to these words. Open people's eyes to see, ears to hear, hearts to respond spirits to dance beautiful child come take one more step closer I stand up and I take a step and it is like taking a step into thick golden glory tangible glory it wraps around me and the glory, the feeling of love. I can feel it through my body on the earth. I pray others in the world can feel this now, my Lord. I pray there is a release of heaven and a head permeating into our atmosphere on the earth right now. And that many can feel this presence, the presence of heaven, the love and peace of heaven. My child, you are bringing heaven to earth. You are releasing my atmosphere. Through your temple. You are both standing before your Lord night and day to deliver this message this end time message for my children in the world. Many will reject all you are saying, many will laugh and mock, thinking they know better, thinking they know me better than Karahash you, Karahash and that is okay my children, let it go. Do not listen, do not engage, do not worry. I will protect you from their comments, their harsh words, their negative attitudes and ways, their mocking and laughing, condescension. Let me deal with these children, their rudeness. And you just fly, continue to fly, continue to walk in peace. Continue to worship each day and I promise every day for another thousand days you will spend with me in paradise. And these words will be heard by millions around the world. Through generations.
Many people, tribes and tongues will fall to their naked knees in worship, in surrender, in love. I love you this day, my child. I love you forevermore. And tomorrow we will go deeper again. Deeper and further into my glorious kingdom. The glorious kingdom of heaven is now being released through words in spirit and truth on the earth for all to see so that knees will bow and tongues confess that I am their Lord. Now is the time for this revelation, the revelation of heaven on earth. Thank you, my child, for all you are doing in my name. You will stay here. You will not return. Physically, you will move about your earth and very much be aware of all you are doing. But in spirit and truth, you are here for eternity. This is my reward and gift unto you both for all you have done for me during your lifetime your obedience and faithfulness unto my will. This is my gift unto you this day. There is nothing you need to do. Just receive. Just come. And I will show you things man has never seen before. So that souls are saved. Knees bow. Tongues confess. And many walk into paradise at life's end. Many are saved. Amen.